This video will show you how easy it is to set up and manage your email addresses. I'm going to show you the great power you now have at your disposal and how you can control your emails like never before. So to access your email management service, you click the envelope icon and then you choose um, manage email addresses. You'll see a list of any emails that have already been set up for each domain that you have. Now in these basic settings that you're shown, you can choose the prefix that you want here. You can choose whether or not you want all the emails that are sent to this address to be redirected to another email address, uh, perhaps your personal one. Um, and if so, which destination address you want to use. Make any changes you want here and then click submit. And that's it. Cool, right? How easy is that? Now, if for any reason you're still not getting those emails, then do a test. Click on the test button. This will send a dummy email to the address you've just created and so we'll check if the destination address is receiving the emails. A little word of caution here, it is up to the destination address how they deal with redirected mail. Over the years we've had some problems with AOL and BT and very occasionally Hotmail. They tend to be a little fickle and you might find that redirected mails sometimes end up in your spam box. Now, so far we've looked at the simple mail redirection service and for many clients this works perfectly. You get to pick up your mail in the same way as you've always done but advertise a professional email address linked to your domain. Sounds perfect right? Sure but there are some pitfalls and the most significant is that if you reply to the email the from address will be your personal email address. This can be a little confusing. Some customer sends an email to, to in this case, martin at wordprints.co.uk and then they get a reply from some email at gmail.com. If this could be a problem for you, then we've got a solution. Rather than simply redirecting the mail to your address, we will store all incoming mail on your own dedicated mail service. And this can be done using the professional mail service that we offer. So, to do this, just click the yellow Pro Mailbox button. And here, you can choose to switch on the mailbox, add your own password, choose options that you want, and simply click Update. Ta-da! Job done. And you might notice that there's a little green icon over on the left-hand side there which indicates that for this email address you have set up a mailbox. Now what exactly is a mailbox? Well, um, essentially we are now storing all of these emails in your cloud-based mail server. This means that you can now pull down all that email onto your own devices, whether it's a tablet, a PC, a phone, and we also give you access to a web-based webmail service so you can connect and pick up and send emails from that webmail service to your heart's content. It is perhaps also worth mentioning that you can have your cake and eat it. You can have both copies of incoming mail sent to your personal email mailbox as well as storing them on your own server using the pro mailbox service as we've just done. But one final caveat, with great power comes great responsibility. Remember, once you set up a mailbox, all your emails are going to be stored there. If we were then to go ahead and delete that email address or rename it, the entire mailbox and all of its contents will be permanently removed. Gone. And if you want any additional, you know, multiple email addresses, then you just click this button here. And uh, you can then set up as many emails as you need. So I hope this has been helpful and you're now confident and excited about creating and managing your own email addresses.